What's up, dudes? And we're back here on some more Beyblade Battles. Ooh, yeah. Today, dudes, in a real life anime stadium, we have an epic triple battle with Devil Belly Owl right here versus Saber Valkyrie going up against Vanish Fafnir. Guys, are you ready for some epic battles? Ready. Then let's do it. Free to Eric. Okay, my dudes, let's see how well Saber Valkyrie does when he's up against other Beyblades. Because the other day, when we had three Saber Valkyries in there, they kept on bursting. But right now, there's only one Saber Valkyrie in there. And as you guys can see, it has not burst yet. Holy moly, it's actually doing pretty good. It does go down. Now it is. It's not Dynamite Belly Out. It's Devil Belly Out. Because we have the Devil Blade, my dudes. All right. Right, so uh, the uh, Valkyrie we are actually going to be using, guys, is the Awakened one as well. I'm going to show you in a second, but let's see which Beyblade gets the first win. It's going to be Coast, but it will be Fafnir. All right, so this is going to be the Awakened version, just so you guys know. Three, two, and every. Woo! Epic smash attacks right there, my dude. Oh, the jumping ability is real right there. I save of Valkyrie. Guys, you know what? I know uh, this new Valkyrie is like super gimmicky, but uh, let's be honest, it's actually so cool when it does jump around. Nice smash attack right there, and it almost uh, got some spin stealing to get back up, but it went down. And again, we have Fafnir and Devil Belly out, battling it out in the middle of the real life anime stadium. Here we go, who's gonna get it? Will it be Fafnir? Will it be Belly out? It's gonna be a very, very close battle, but it will be Fafnir. Three, two, and three. All right, guys, next round is up right here. Wait till we get that jump. There it is. Oh, ho, ho, ho. I love it. Yeah, the, ju the jumping is pretty good. Even in the real life anime stadium, the jumping is actually really, really epic. I'm digging it, man. All right, guys, so far it's all been free, and he's banished Fafnir Beyblade. Will there be any other winners in these battles? Saber Valkyrie definitely not going to win right there. The rubber spin stealing uh, Fafnir gets the contact, what it needed. It looks like it's about to get the win, and that time I think it may have been a draw. Three, two, and every. Whoa! Woo! And whoa! My dude, that was absolutely insane right there. The smash attacks were real. <laughs> I almost thought Belly Out lost control right there from uh, hitting the walls, but somehow it at all. Oh, we need to come on. Come on, Valkyrie, you can spin still. Make some contact there with the rubber of Fafnir. No! Just the Beyblade, it didn't want to hit, and it made contact with Belly Out, and it took him down. Woo! Only if it made contact with Fafnir. That was so close, my dudes. And again, another close battle, but it will be a Fafnir win. Three, two, and every. And yes! Nice smash attacks there, guys. And it's always the Valkyrie Beyblade that gives the big hits, my dudes. There we go. It needs to uh, battle against Fafnir. And come on, he can do it. I want to spin still, guys. No! Every time it's about to make contact with Fafnir, Bell sees it, comes in with his belly out Beyblade and takes out Valkyrie every single time. No way. Come on, Saber Valkyrie. We need you to get a win. Bolt needs to uh, realize he makes he needs to make contact with the Fafnir Beyblade to stay in the battle. Can Beliel get it? It's going to be close. It'll be a draw or Fafnir. I'm not too sure. You guys decide in the comments below. Three, two, and every. Oh, yes. Woo. All right. So far, guys, uh, check this out. We have had no birth. That's right. Valkyrie has not burst yet. Holy moly. That's actually a massive shocker right there. If you guys saw the three-way triple battle the other day, with all three Valkyrie Beyblades, we had the sleeping version, the awake version, and the butchered version. Every single time they launched it, they would literally get destroyed. Just to see no Beyblade burst today, that is an absolute shocker right now. And it's a Fafnir win? Three, two, and every. And oh! All right, guys, uh, as you can tell, it's all 
Fafnir today in low mode. At the moment, you know, all three Beyblades are in low mode. Don't worry, we will change to high mode halfway through the battles, but not just yet. I want to see... Oh, what an attack right there to split all three Beyblades up. And again, guys, so close. Let's see if Belial can get a win. Come on, Belial. Yeah. Yes, the Devil Blade gets the win. Free to your every... Oh, oh, woo! <laughs> that is epic right there, guys. Oh, wow. All right, yeah. You know, Valkyrie, like the super gimmiest Valkyrie we've ever had, giving us some nice smash attacks right there. Stay on contact with Fafni. What are you doing? No! Every single time, it's like it get gravitated towards Belial. Why does it do that? All right, here we go, guys. I think Belial may have just stole that again. Free to your every... Woo! And a dynamite Belial. And, oh, sorry, should we say Devil Belial. And Saber Valkyrie going in with them big smash attacks. But yet again, no burst. <laughs> That's absolutely insane. Have we fixed Valkyrie? Is there no more bursting for Valkyrie? The stamina is not doing good, but it's not bursting. Uh, guys, I'm not going to lie. I thought that launching Valkyrie this many times, we were going to have a ton of bursts and it would just be these two always bad it out. But you know what? It's actually doing a good job and I don't even know how to call it. Fafnir draw? I don't know. You guys call it. Free to your every... Oh, whoa! All right, guys. Epic, big smash attacks right there. Let's see if Valkyrie has learned to make that contact. Oh, yo, we get a burst right there. It was the Valkyrie. How could he win to make contact? Let's see if Valkyrie can get his first win by spin stealing off Fafnir. Uh oh, uh oh, guys, he might do it. He may do it. It's going to be so close. But no, Fafnir comes in, but we get our first burst. And Valkyrie actually was not the Beyblade to burst. It was belly out to burst. Holy moly. Three, two, and every. And my dude, as you guys just saw, we got our very first burst. And it was not Valkyrie. <laughs> it was a Valkyrie. Like, really? Oh, wow. It was the devil belly out Beyblade right there. Nice attacks. As you guys can see, Valkyrie knows its weakness right there is them smash attacks. It's trying, it's trying to go in for belly out. It's spinning of Fafnir, but it goes down. Woo! That was revenge right there by Bell. We actually saw him burst. Holy moly. And Fafnir wins. Free to your every. All right, guys. This is going to be the last battle in low mode. So. This is low mode. We're going to change it after into high mode and see what happens. Hopefully, we get a whole bunch of more attacks and bursts. But right there, Valkyrie goes down. All right, here we go. Let's see if uh, Devil Belly Out can get the final win in low mode. Or will Fafnir and his uh, free owner be able to take another win away from the bay? All right, here we go, guys. Another super, super close battle, but it's going to be... Who's going to be? Fafnir. Fafnir. All right, let's get into high mode. Three, two, one, three. All right, guys, there we go. Now we have the high mode activated. Let's see how they perform now. Normally in the Dynamite Stadium, when you go into high mode, they are a ton more aggressive. Real Life Anime Stadium could be a little bit different there. It looks like Valkyrie goes down again, and that stamina is just so bad. But, you know, the Dolphin gimmick is super awesome. We've actually seen a burst, and yet, you know, it was not Valkyrie, so that makes it even more epic. Even though he hasn't won any battles yet, it's still cool that he hasn't burst yet. And Fafnir gets it. Free to your every... And my boys, there we go. Valkyrie coming in the center once again. The job activated, but this time it looks like Valkyrie wants to try and stay out of the action as long as possible to keep that stamina up. It needs to make a contact with Fafnir. Stay with Fafnir. Bolt, you need to stay with Fafnir. There you go. That's what he needs to do. Make that contact. Spin steal. Can it do it? It did get a little bit of contact right there, but it's... Oh, see, guys? If it just made some more contact with Fafnir, it would have stayed in. But Fafnir gets the win. Free to every... All right, my boys. Oh! 
big attack right there on Fafnir. You guys can definitely see the uh, difference in the same Valkyrie in high mode. A lot more aggressive, a lot more going around the stadium. But with that, it's actually losing all its power when it's attacking. That's the only bad thing about going around. And there you go. That is the consequences of just going around. But Dynamite Belly out gets to win. Three, two, one, and three. All right, my dudes. And let's see if that jumping can go at all. When you needed the Beyblades all to be in the middle, they weren't. They knew to get out of the way of Saber Valkyrie's jumping attack right there. Ho <laughs> ho! All right, nice contact there. And no! As soon as it touched the belly out, it went down. Wow! All right, guys, it's going to be a win for Fafnir. Three, two, one, three. And yes, all three bays in the center now, guys. Jumping ability works, and there it is. Woo! That's what you see when Valkyrie jumps and makes them epic smash attacks right there, guys. All three bays in the center. And again, a nice little attack to Fafnir. Ho, ho, ho. The attacks are real with the new Valkyrie. Guys, in the comments below, let me know what you guys feel of the new Valkyrie. Do you like it? Don't you like it? Do you think the gimmick is good or bad? It's going to be a win for Belly. I don't know. That was so close. Three, two, and three. All right, my boys. And once again, we're just waiting for that jumping gimmick straight through the center. That jumping gimmick went straight through the center of Bell and free. Missed the attack. Oh, I want to see another burst now, guys. You guys know Super Beyblade family loves them burst. And oh, it goes down. So sad to see Valkyrie always go down. It's been like this for so many evolutions, man. But Fafnir gets that. Three, two, and three. All right, guys. And there we go. Nice smash attack. Oh, yeah. That's what we're aiming for, guys. We want to get them big smash attacks on Devil Belly out right there. See if we can actually burst it again. Nice attack. And again, it goes down. Oh, no. I want to see if there's actually any clicks now on Devil Belly out just to see if it was close to burst. And he does get the win. And, oh, guys, only one click. Three, two, one, and three. Ooh. All right, guys. And Fafnir, oh. All right, guys. Fafnir, oh. Okay. That was close, close. That, 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 that was super close right there. Fafnir got knocked into oblivion. Completely lost control. Let's see if somehow Valkyrie can beat Devil Belly out. It's, it's not going to happen. <laughs> Three, two, and three. And my dudes, there we go. Can we get a big job? There it was, yes. The concentrated attacks. Did you just see that double attack right there, guys, by Fafnir and Valkyrie on a belly out? Woo! This is what I'm talking about. These triple battles are absolutely epic. Fafnir's been taken out once again. Guys, you know what? It has mostly been Fafnir wins, but Belly Out's got a ton of wins as well, but we still haven't seen a Valkyrie win yet. Three, two, and three. And my dudes, we are coming down to no! All right, guys, these are like the last final couple of battles right now. Let's see if uh, the mighty uh, Valkyrie can at least get one win before it all ends. And with stamina like that, it's not gonna happen. We need to somehow burst another Beyblade again and get the win. All right, here we go, guys. Will it be Fafnir? Will it be Belial? It's gonna be super close, but it's gonna be Fafnir. Three, two, one, every. All right, my dudes, and yes. Whoa, that's exactly what we needed right there, guys. A big attack on Devil Belly Out. But uh, I feel like the height on Valkyrie is just way, way, way too tall now. You guys can definitely see in high mode, it's suffering from how tall it is, man. Why did they do this? <laughs> it's cool, but wow. All right, here we go. Dynamite Belly Out gets it. Or should we say Devil Belly Out? 
Three, two, one, Eric. Okay, my dudes, this is it. The finale battle with Beyblade will get the final win in the final showdown in the real life anime stadium. It's not going to be Valkyrie. You guys can see a little bit of a letdown that Valkyrie didn't get one win. But we did, we, we, at least we got to see a burst. We did get to see a burst. And you know what, guys? There's kind of something cool that actually happened here. Save a Valkyrie did not burst, not even once. Can you believe it? Who would have ever thought we would have seen a battle with Valkyrie, the new Dynamite Valkyrie, and it would never have burst? Fafnir gets to win. Okay, my dudes, there you go. The final battles are right there. And as you guys can see, wah, wah, wah. Valkyrie's upside down because he lost so many battles, man. But guess what? Like I said, it did not burst. This somehow actually did. Fafnir got the most wins with a close second. Or was it close? I don't know, man. But, you know, it got a lot of wins anyway. More than I thought it was going to. But uh, Valkyrie no wins again. If you guys want to see any triple or four-way battles, let us know in the comments below which base should all go head-to-head. -head. But until then, we'll see you in the next episode, dude. Yeah.